Hey guys, Ashen1 here, and welcome to this Metroid Dread video on how to beat the first boss, Corpius. If you like my channel, please like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon. Okay, let's jump straight in. There are three main phases to the fight, and naturally, we will start with Phase 1. There are three attacks you need to worry about in this first phase. The first is this poison spitball here, but this will give us loot, so we will use this to replenish our health and missiles, so consider this a good one. And there are two tail attacks. Now, how you respond to the tail attacks all depends on whether the tail is swiping or thrusting, and you will know whether it swipes or thrusts by the animation to begin with. So, when the tail curls up like this, it's going to swipe, so you just need to jump, and when the tail points forward like this, it's going to thrust, so you just need to run in under it and melt down the boss. And on to the second phase. So in this phase, the boss will activate its stealth mode, but don't worry, we can still see it. All we have to do is look a little bit harder for the tail attacks. Same tail attacks, and all we have to do is shoot the glowing orb on the tail. So just rinse and repeat, and you should be able to get through this phase very quickly. Now, what's interesting is, at the end of this phase, when we start the third phase, we're pretty much going to be doing some new stuff, but with all of the stuff up until this point. So the first thing you're going to want to do is slide under Corpius, and then get ready to counter. So as you can see here, you get a great opportunity to really get some damage off on him, and go into this whole cutscene where you just have free melting. But, don't make the mistake I did. Here I am, panicking, not knowing what's going on, and I'm just shooting him with the normal blaster. What you want to do is hold down R and just melt him with missiles. You'll see this towards the end of the fight, how it should be properly done. Okay, so in this phase, we're going to have some new attacks, pretty much just one attack. He will spit his poison onto the floor, and it will start coming after you, but you may have noticed in the cutscene between phase 2 and 3 that he also broke the wall with his tail. So now we have a magnetic strip that we can jump to to avoid the poison cloud. And as you can see, we can still shoot away at him and melt him down. All you have to do is watch out for the tail, shoot some of the poison spit that he fires at you, and rinse and repeat. Here I have an opportunity to slide back under him, knowing I'm going to get the counter this time, but this time I'm going to use my missiles, and you can see the opportunity here to get a hell of a lot of damage off on him. And there we have it, guys. As you can see, no need to rinse and repeat much now. The boss goes down, and that is Corpius done nice and easy. So, I will let the fight go uninterrupted now so you can watch it, but before I do, tell me, how did you find this boss? What did I miss to make it easier, if anything? and how you find in the game in general. Cheers guys, I'll see you in the next one.